Hey folks, this is Matt once again with another unpackaging from the one uh, First Power 100. He sent me another package. He asked for me to open it on camera and I'm like, yeah, that's the least I can do. So I have no idea what's in this, but uh, I'm showing it like this so I don't sh show his address. So let's see what this is. Cause he got me. I sh by now I should be uploading the Blade the Animated series. I'm wondering what this is. I have no idea what this could be. <clears throat> oh, there's a piece of paper. <clears throat> okay. I'll probably read it after, so it'll be a surprise to see what I got. Oh wow. Wow. Samuel Jackson is Afro Samurai, the director's cut. Wow, this is like a solid thing. Wow. I have never seen this. Afro Samurai is an epic tale of a black samurai's hunt for justice. Who murders his father? With music scored by the Riza, Afro Samurai blends traditional Japanese culture, funky technology, and hip hop to create a brutally fresh entertainment experience. Director's cut is 125 minutes. So it's a movie? Or is it a TV show? I guess it's a movie. Or is it a TV show? I'm not. Unedited dialogue, pictures as they're meant to be seen. 15 minutes and never before seen footage, including the extended ending. Original artwork from the creator Takashi Okazaki. In the booth, the voice talent of Afro Samurai. Riza Music Production. Two disc special edition Afro Samurai. Wow. I've never seen this, so you guys can let me know how this is. Oh, it goes like this. This is very like solid, like it feels nice. Wow. Sorry, this I'm feeling it up. And uh, let's see how does it open? Oh, opens all right. Opens like wow. That is solid. Wow, look at that. Wow. Look at that. I've never. I've heard. I think Michael has talked about this. I believe. Oh, opens up like that. It's a two disc director's cut. Oops, it's gonna fall out. Please don't fall out. Uh, I'll hold it like this then. And then a booklet. The anime source, which is Oh, other stuff that they have that you can buy, I guess. I believe. I mean, this is a movie. Is that song with a teddy bear head? Teddy bear head. Huh. And of all officially licensed merchandise. Wow. This had to have been really expensive. Because it looks expensive. I mean, it's very solid. It's got weight to it. It looks cool. I like Samuel Jackson and Ron Perlman, voice of the bad guy, Sam Jackson, the good guy. 
New York Times, excellent. IGN.com, kick ass. If you've seen this, feel free to let me know your, your thoughts on this. But uh, I will review this when I see it. Wow. There's more. Oh, there's another one. Afro Samurai Resurrection. There's another one. One brother, one path, 1,000 deaths. Sorry, I'm reading. Oh, Lucy Liu is now the bad guy or girl. Featuring the voice of Mark Hamill and fresh production from the RZA. The sequel to the best selling anime DVD of 2007. Ah, so there is a second one. TVMA, Sam Jackson is back. Association of Spike TV. This one's 95 minutes. So Afro Samurai 2, I guess. Resurrection. Oh, there's a disc. So two discs. Disc one is the Blood of Heroes with Rudyard Howard and Joe Chen. Ooh, the Peacemaker Robert Forster. I've heard of this movie. I've heard of this movie. Disc two, the Dogs of War. Or Christopher Walken. The Dogs of War. Why why does that name sound familiar? The Dogs of War with Christopher Walken. The Dogs of War. I'm not gonna play the trailer, but I just the Dogs of War, that seems familiar. Why does that seem familiar? Christopher Walken, Tom Berenger. Huh. Saw so, um, my friend Mike OCP's his Action Pat Cinema, the trailer for it. Oh, this is an action film where it's like people trying to rescue. Huh. Chris Walken in action movie. I know he did no one called Mid Bane, but already he had this one, nineteen eighty. Interesting. Let's see what the note says. Hey Matt, this is first part one hundred. I got you these cool DVDs that I hope you will enjoy. I also included two DVDs of a nineteen ninety alien sci fi flick called Peacemaker, starring Rudder Howard. Robert Forster and a weird Rudger Hauer futuristic film called The Blood of Heroes. On disc 2, there's an early 80s film called The Dawes of War starring Chris Walken. Enjoy them in the new year. Keep up the reviews and hope that you enjoy these flicks as much as I do. Wow. Wow. Well, all I can say is thank you so much for this. So we have two discs of Peacemaker with Robert Forster and The Blood of Heroes with Rudder Howard, which I've heard good things about. This two is The Dogs of War with Christopher Walken. And then Afro Samurai and Afro Samurai Resurrection. I can do this. So, wow. Thank you so much. Um, I don't know what else I could say. Just thank you so much for this gift. It's very kind of you. Um, I'm sure he wants me to review these, so I'll try to get them ASAP. I don't know when. 
I still have a few other ones that I have to get to still been sort of lolly dadding around but thank you so much for this kind gift uh, first power 100 I don't want to say his first name in case he doesn't want me to but uh, thank you so much for the kind gift and uh, it's weird when I get stuff I never know what to say because it's just it's a surprise and it's humbling so I I don't know as well as I can say, but thank you so much for that. And uh, I'll say again, I hope you all had a Merry Christmas. I hope you all will have a safe New Year. And uh, maybe by this time I'll upload a, a review that I had saved up for a film that someone else has sent me called Mutant. But once again, First Power 100, thank you so much. And... Uh, a lot of nice guys on here, a lot of nice people on here, willing to spend money on stuff. This like these seem expensive too. Not only that, but the shipping as well. It is, I'm not really worth it. But sincerely, thank you very much, and I hope each one of you people out there have a nice day. Bye bye.